Welcome back to my channel. Today is a very exciting day and I'm going to take you guys along. You guys will understand why it's so exciting and I can't wait to tell you guys. So just keep on watching this video if you want to know why I'm so freaking excited. You ready dirty Abby? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so we are about to tell you guys what the surprise is or what the good news for our family is. And when I went ahead and told you guys on Instagram, you guys all thought that I was pregnant. And... Oh, why am I opening this door? Shit. And... That's really cute. Oh. That's so cute! Yes. Congrats, guys! That's Gecko, what? <laughs> There's two, yay! Oh, yay. yay! Sebastian, what is that? That's a key to your home! Yay! How do you feel, George? Yeah. You're How a you homeowner! Super excited. Aw, yes, congratulations! So now you have nothing. I know! <laughs> Okay, we should. You want to do a picture right now? Yeah. In front. Oh, okay. I got you guys a little basket so you can celebrate. I got the baby a little gift. Oh, <laughs> thank you. That's so cute. Yeah. And the lines and the odor. <laughs> oh, George. Yeah. <laughs> Celebration. Oh. That's so cute. Thank you. Of course. It's a fun, exciting time. Yeah, I it. You're welcome so much. Okay, yeah, you guys are homeowners. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to take it in. Let me take it in. First. I know. It's kind of crazy. It's really weird because every time we come, like, I have to lie. I didn't know you were talented. Hey. We're cheering. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> Alright, you guys do cheers since I don't drink. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Yay. Congrats. Yay. Mm -hmm. Hard work paid off, George? The They're still cold, huh? Well, what about the limon? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, you have to open this one. Oh, okay. Oh, look at yeah, that. Yeah, it's We open them. Okay. Let me, let me open it. <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. So you have a little bit of reminder of everything. She got this gift card too. So Ever, and it's like my what does it say? They're engraved. Yeah. With her information, you guys look for Minerva. <laughs> have to give her a shout out. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Remember who to call. Yes. <laughs> oh, thank you. Do you want to look? Yeah, we go. Yeah. yeah. So now that you have, now that you have the special tip, do we have a? Why Here you go. You can do it on the wrap. Yeah. You do it on the counter. <laughs> <laughs> you break your back. Yeah. To take one more sip. Oh, go. Go. Cheers to the new house. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> How exciting. Sebastian says because moving is time consuming, but you still you still have to eat. So she got his Domino's. Aw. Because moving is hard work and coffee helps. Yes, it does. And then she got his chocolate. She got Sebastian some <laughs> snacks. Lemon, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look, Abby. Gummy. <gasps> gummy bears. I said gummy worms, gummy bears. <laughs> Pringles. She even got him a toy. Oh, I'm zoomed in. What the heck? 
Oh, that's a toy. Oh. No. Hold on, I forgot which one. Yeah. Okay. There you go. Oh, no. <laughs> wow. Make him laugh, Abby. Hi, Bubba. Hi, Bubba. <gasps> She's not as good as Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, uh, no. Sebastian. Sebastian. Oh. Sebastian. A book a book. No. Baby shark to do 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 do. Baby shark to do 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 do. Baby shark. He's like nine. Sebastian. You're like in my hair. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. Sebastian. Hi, honey. Where are you? Um. He's like, I mean, but this is a portrait, so this is really cute. Sebastian, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I like the live ones, but. Portrait? No, I just look that. Sebastian, come, I'm gonna get you. That's cute. Look at this. You said portrait, you said? Yeah. Only one? Um, I took a few in the very beginning. Behind the scenes. Like those. That one's cute. Yeah, I like those better. Those three are super, yeah. super cute. Yeah. Okay, Airdrop. I'll send them to you. Hi. That's cute. Thank you so much. I thought you were hugging me. No, I am. I am. I am. Okay, you can leave now. Wait, Olga. Olga. Did you think he was hugging you too? I thought he was. He's just laughing at me. Oh. Because I'm leaving now. I thought he was trying to kick me out. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, to just reach for the beer. <laughs> right. He was so excited. <laughs> yes, so as you guys can see, me and George are officially homeowners and it's amazing. It's an amazing feeling. I can't even describe it. Like I feel like it hasn't hit me. I feel like I have butterflies. Has it hit you? It hasn't hit me yet. No, huh? So we've been in the process of looking for a home for about like two months or so. As you guys know, I've been showing in my vlogs that we've been looking at different homes and we finally ran into this home. We put the offer as soon as we could and we got the house and it's a beautiful home. I cannot wait to show you guys. And before all this, I do want to say I'm so freaking proud of you. You literally did this all on your own. Like you did this. You did this. Thank you. It hasn't hit you either. Huh? Yeah, I feel like we're like speechless because we're, that's literally how we feel. We feel so freaking happy that we have no words, but we have a home. Our home. Our home. Our home. <laughs> I want to cry. It's a trip. It's a trip. Honestly, it's, I mean, for those of you guys who don't know my story, um, you know, I was born in Santa Maria in a city about an hour from Santa Barbara, um, Pismo Beach area. And I uh, moved over here to the Bay Area. That's where we met. Yeah, that's where we met. And uh, when I was 23, barely turned 24. Um, and I uh, moved over here to work construction. I worked on the Bay Bridge, uh, pouring concrete as a laborer, and 
stripping forms for those guys who know construction. Mm -hmm. uh, worked my way up to be a union carpenter doing high rise buildings in San Francisco, Oakland. I did the, worked on the new Warrior Stadium, Chase Center. Um, I also worked the fire department. Um, yeah, so I think they don't know the part. So I'm gonna talk about a little bit after this, but he did work two jobs yeah. and um, he was a firefighter. And that's the side that you guys mostly saw, but go ahead and continue and tell them about like, everything yeah i mean it's a i worked as a forest firefighter for two years down south near, near santa barbara area about five years ago and then i got back into the fire service about a year and a half ago um can't say the city where i worked at for privacy issues and yeah. but uh yeah i learned a lot uh you know it felt good to give back to my community and uh Fortunately, you know, I I don't really got that much time right now. I got to really focus on the construction side of it, you know, but um, I'm definitely going to give uh, my 100% towards uh, construction. construction right now. And then uh, uh, later on, uh, hopefully, go back. Able, yeah, go back to being know. a firefighter. Yeah. yeah, so basically it all goes back to when I got pregnant and I, as you guys might know, I worked at the bank. I was there for four years. And whenever I got pregnant, the whole time like I was pregnant, I always thought that I was gonna go back to work, you know, because I was used to being independent and providing for myself. And so was him, you know, you were used to providing just for yourself because yeah. you lived on your own. And then whenever, I actually had Sebastian and we didn't have our parents nearby for him for anybody to take care of Sebastian and we didn't want to just leave him in daycare so we went ahead and decided that I wasn't gonna go back to work and for me at that point it was a little bit depressing I know a lot of people would love to be stay-at-home moms but for me at that point it was a little bit depressing only because I was so used to working for myself and also, like, I in the back of my head, I, I also thought about him, like, how is he going to, like, take the responsibility of, like, providing for all of us, you know, if I can work. But whenever you have a baby, like, you learn to sacrifice. And I left my job, you know, and he's now working so hard in order to provide for us. And he literally had two jobs, as you guys know. He wakes up super, super early, goes to work, and then on weekends would do the fire department and he was just like tired he was tired all the time but he literally worked his ass off to get us a home and that is why I'm, like i'm extremely extremely blessed of, of the fact that he allowed me to be home to stay with my baby and it's a blessing it's a blessing for me to be able to see all of sebastian's new changes like the new things that he does and i owe it all to him you know he's my backbone he's my support he's he's the one doing all this and he's doing it for us so, I'm so happy that I have a real man in my life. Love you. Love you too. And, yeah, I'm so proud. Um, I I say that he did this all on his own because I am a stay-at-home mom. And that is hard work. But I don't have a set income. Even though I started social media, like, a couple months ago, I can't say that I'm at all depending on social media or I make money, enough money or anything like that. Like, we don't depend on me at all, you know, it's all him, it's all his hard work, it's all his early mornings, his late nights, like everything, we owe it to him. So I'm extremely blessed, I'm so happy that we have our home, and yeah. I lost the keys, I lost, <laughs> the, I lost keys. the keys, get it. <laughs> yeah, your keys. Yeah, I have my key right here too. Oh, can I get it? Pop the camera? Yay, we are homeowners. We are homeowners. <laughs> yeah, we, oh my God, you guys, I can't wait to like do, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do like the empty house tour and all those videos for you guys because I used to get excited when people used to do them and I never thought that this time would come so soon for me. You know, I freaking stopped working at like 24 years old. I am 25 right now and I have a house and you know a lot of people own homes and I'm sure it's like you guys know what it feels like it's 
such a huge accomplishment. I am beyond, beyond happy. <laughs> George, George can't believe it. He's still like in awe. I need another Corona. You need another Corona? Yeah, another Corona. Ay, ay, ay. I, I'm super excited. Yeah. Exactly. Alrighty, so I am going to end this vlog here. My next vlog should probably be the empty house tour, which I'm excited about. But anything else you want to say? Super excited and uh, homeowners. <laughs> yeah, and then um, people did tell me or like message me saying they wanted to see videos of like in general how we did it everything all the steps we took to own a home because they knew we were in the process join the union yeah join the union <laughs> <laughs> yeah so we'll make sure to get onto those videos but yeah thank you so much for watching this vlog and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys peace peace show the key show the key hold on sebastian oh you gotta get some Coming but it we would not be yeah it would not be possible without this oh, little person right come here on. he's for sure gonna learn how to walk oh oh no Basically, you can play, you can play music and there's Mexican music at Applebee's, so we're really enjoying our food. Look, he's all excited. Aww, he's so cute. Watch, when they're gonna get home for work, is the best gonna be taking on that Ay, sí, ya, sí, ya, mamá, no me complain, mamá. Y le dije, no, 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 no,